Here's a good rule of thumb. If your nine or 10 year old can't pronounce all the ingredients, you probably don't need to be eating it. If it has seven, eight, nine, ten ingredients on the package, you probably don't need to be eating it either. If it doesn't go bad, you probably don't need to be eating that thing. You know, I would say one of the most common questions um, that I get from viewers, and not just here in Alabama, but through my whole career of 20 plus years in TV, is how do you stay slender with three kids, or how do you stay slender? Right. And I always say, my dinner table at night consists of always a protein, yep. always a meat, whether it be steak or chicken or pork, mm -hmm. something that's a meat protein, and then fruit and then vegetables. We rarely have carbs on the table, right. not because of, I've never dieted in my life, <clears throat> but because I feel like I operate, my body operates better on fuel that's plant-based, veggie-based, um, you know, fruit and meat based. Right, absolutely. So the things that you mentioned, you didn't realize you did this. The things that you mentioned there that were critical, everything that you mentioned had one ingredient. What? One ingredient, it's a meat, it's a vegetable, it's fruit. You didn't say something that has 47 ingredients. Mm -hmm. You mentioned one ingredient item items. If we can, can eat those things, Here's a good rule of thumb. If your nine or 10 year old can't pronounce all the ingredients, you probably don't need to be eating it. If it has seven, eight, nine, ten 10 ingredients on the package, you probably don't need to be eating it either. If it doesn't go bad, you probably don't need to be eating that thing. Yes, so maybe lots of items that are uh, heavy in um, preservatives and yes, and yes okay, and dot, red dyes right. and different things like that. 85% of the items in the grocery store have added sugar. Yes. If we can avoid, if we can avoid two things, I've, I've figured out. Not, I haven't got it figured out, but I've, I've seen. If we can avoid two things, we will have greater success. One thing: if we can avoid flour, we will have a little bit more success. And if we can avoid processed sugar, we can have some success. Those two things right there. If we can just okay. eliminate.